And the campaign for the New Hampshire Republican presidential primary, it's intense with Donald Trump and Nikki Haley. And in that two-person race. And that's where we find CBS 2's political reporter, Marsha Kramer, who caught up with some young campaigners from our area, Marsha. Well, Dana, political candidates are not the only ones who are braving the cold and the frigid temperatures here in Manchester, New Hampshire. A group of students from Maranek High School are here on the ground getting on the ground political experience. It's been said that Iowa picks corn and New Hampshire picks presidents. Joe Liberti is not a New Hampshire voter. He's a political science teacher at Maranek High School who brought a busload of students here to experience political campaigning firsthand. They're trying to get out the vote for Nikki Haley and her daunting battle with Donald Trump. I'm calling to invite you to a rally with Nikki Haley. And but getting people to support the former South Carolina governor is sometimes an uphill battle. Either people just say good luck, people don't answer, or a lot of them are angry Trump supporters. <laughs> so what do you say to the angry Trump supporters? They just say, like, no, we're Trump family, we're voting for Trump, no Nikki Haley here. But despite some pushback, the students are excited for the opportunity to participate in national politics. I mean, I've never had a chance before. Of course, I've always loved political discourse, you know, discussions, model Congress and AP Gov and everything, but I've never really got a chance to be on the ground before actually making a difference kind of physically in the thick of politics. I've only ever discussed it or seen it on TV. And while while not all of them are Nikki Haley supporters, they think their efforts on her behalf will pay off. I definitely think it's going to have an impact on the race, uh, specific, just because Nikki Haley is seen to be polling so well with independents, and we're uh, trying to bring these independent voters out. Why Nikki Haley? Um, I think she's a strong candidate right now, and although Personally, my political views don't necessarily align with hers. I do think that it's still a good experience, nonetheless. We're living in a time with much more political polarization. People are wanting to check out. And this is really asking the students right now to lean in. Now, despite their enthusiasm, the students won't find out until tomorrow night whether their efforts have paid off. But I'm sure either way, their teacher will give them high marks. <laughs> Live in Manchester, New Hampshire, I'm Marsha Kramer, CBS 2 News. What a great experience being part of the process. Marsha, thank you.